If you're still launching like it's 2021, you're gonna start seeing some issues with the number of people buying, if you haven't already. Things have changed in the market and launching in the same tired way isn't going to be bringing you the results you need. If you're frustrated because you used to get great launch results, but now it just isn't working like it did, don't worry. Launching still works brilliantly. My own multi-million dollar launches and my clients' epic six to seven figure launches are proof of this. But you do need to change a few things about how you launch. Here are a few things we used to do and what we're doing now instead. So in 2021, most people would use ads or breadcrumbing groups with a quick PDF lead magnet two weeks before launch to get the audience numbers up. Now we incorporate an ultra build event to add huge numbers to our lists that are the exact types of people needed to buy the end product. In 2021, we'd have a webinar or challenge to get eyes on our launch. Now we have a sequence of events to appeal to all the different launch buyer types and their individual needs using ethical buyer psychology. In 2021, most people made wild claims or hype to encourage people to join their webinars or challenges. Now we use gamification to encourage participation, but also to make sure clients get results, even from things that are free in the launch. In 2021, most people had a quick sales page outlining their offer with a couple of bonuses thrown in for good measure. Now we create an Uber offer page that uses design, buyer psychology and copy that really converts to sell. In 2021, people used money back guarantees to reassure that had huge caveats. Now we use credibility marketing and qualification criteria to get the right people into our offers and excited to buy. 